differently than I deserve that. Mm -hmm. I don't deserve to die because somebody miscommunicated or somebody took a guess at what's going on with my leg. It's supposed to die that way. I'm not even supposed to, you're not even supposed to take a chance on that. Because it was your child, if it was your father, if it was your mother, somebody you love, you would have said, go to the doctor. We need to get that checked out. We need to look at that. We need to x-ray that. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's why I'm speaking out on this, because I'm scared for my life in, in, in that area. And who wouldn't be? That's right. Who wouldn't be? Animals better than that. That's right. What's going on? It's your boy Zillion, and welcome to the mother freaking show. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, all the other good stuff. Now, we just heard the audio of R. Kelly. We just heard the audio. Now, I'm going to give you my thoughts about the audio. Um, it may be a medical condition. I don't know, but I think it's a combination of things. I think that once you get behind those walls and you see how many years you have to face, um, reality starts to hit. You know, I think it's really hitting them hard being in there and facing all that time and then there he might be getting neglected too and all that other stuff now i'm gonna say this when when r kelly was little um you know his 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 sister made him uh do some things to her you know he she violated him as a boy i believe some of those issues he never got resolved he never got counseling for what his older sister did to him and also his brother talked about what their older sister did to both of them okay um, for some reason it had I guess it had a dramatic effect on um, R. Kelly where you know he's you see he got some issues he got some problems going on now do I believe everything they're saying no because if you're run, if you're running a trafficking ring other people should be arrested R. Kelly should not be the only one arrested if you're saying he was running a trafficking business okay that is a corporation that is a, a, a slew of people that is an organization that has to help you run that okay so if you're charging him with that there's a lot of other people that should be charged with r kelly but they're not he's the only one arrested because they want to make an example out of him that's it that's why they did the you know the surviving r kelly the whole thing was to bring new charges against this man all right now um if he's really facing some medical condition maybe he get his family or this and that um, to help him out or whatever the case may be maybe get him into a facility where he can get you know they have certain prisons uh, medical prisons where they can help people with medical conditions uh, and this and that so maybe he can get put in one of those um, but I'm your boy Ziggy now I hope he gets counseling in there I hope he seeks God while he's in there but like I said my only issue with this case is what he was being charged with there's other people that should be arrested too that's it if you're charging him with this if you're saying he did all this of all these women coming forth, supposedly, there should be parents arrested for pimping their children. Uh, there should be parents arrested. Yes, yes, because they, they, they pimp their children out to him. And um, there should be some managers, some promoters, some people around him um, that should be arrested too, man. I'm your boy, Zillionaire, giving you the news. I'll keep you updated on R. Kelly's condition. But um, he said he fears for his life. He said he's afraid that he's going to die. Um, I think he may be afraid that he may die in prison. I mean, that like those may be his final days. You know what I'm saying? And um, I think he's thinking about that too, as well as his medical condition. And also with those type of charges, um, somebody may could be, you know, threatening to take his life or something. People could be, you know, guys in prison probably, you know, are saying we're going to do this to you. We're going to do that to you. Oh, you did, you know, because certain charges, you know, you put a target on your back as well. Whether they're true or false, you know what I'm saying? It is the target is going to be on your back in prison. So I think it's a combination of things that R. Kelly is afraid of or fearful of right now. But he better seek the Most High. He better seek God Almighty. He better seek Yah. He better seek Christ and um, get his soul, get his mind right, and uh, all that other good stuff. Um, but I pray for the brother that he comes to the light and that, um, you know, whatever's going on with him, that he give it over to the Lord. I'm your boy Zillionaire. I'm out of here. Let me know what you think about R. Kelly. I'm talking about he fears for his life in prison. 
and uh, saying he has these blood clots and uh, he has a medical condition. But I think he's fearful of a lot of things, not just that. I'm out of here.